Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well. So today's video, I'm gonna be showing you a few of the things that The X Factor did to my 2012 audition video. Um, but before we get started, I just wanna say thank you so much for all the support and love you have shown me since I put my truth video out. I was really, really nervous to put it out, but you guys, it's been overwhelming, the support. Uh, thank you all so, so much. Uh, nearly on a million views now on the Truth video. Uh, just over 30,000 subscribers on YouTube. Amazing. You guys are amazing. Thank you. So I've had a lot of messages asking me to explain what The X Factor did to my audition video and how they did it. So I started having a look through the video and it became pretty clear to me that it was much, much worse than I originally thought. Within the footage, I found lots of very disturbing and shocking images which clearly show how far Simon Cowell's X Factor went to manipulate the feelings and opinions of the general public and incite hatred towards me. There are hundreds of malicious and defamatory images contained within the footage. And if I were to try and show you all of them, this would be a very long video. So I've picked out a few of my favorites to show you. And I've put some pictures of myself on the screen and they're gonna be on the screen the whole time. They're from me from 2012, so that you guys can see what I actually looked like in 2012, and then you can compare it to the X Factor's hateful version of me. So let's have a look at some of the clips from my X Factor 2012 audition.
thank you for watching this video and I just want to say again thank you so much for all the support honestly you don't know what it means to me it means so much um, thank you so you've seen in this video how far the lying lowlife Simon Cowell and his immoral conspirators will go to achieve their aims They'll go as far as brainwashing the public with falsehoods and lies and intentionally causing emotional distress to their victims, some to the point of suicide. But the big question is, how many people have they done this to?